Some weapons make a statement. Some are statements themselves. Enter the GAU-8 Avenger, the most formidable autocannon ever mounted on an aircraft, crafted to decimate main battle tanks and pulverize armored columns. Its distinct sound is a symphony to US ground forces, and for those foes unfortunate enough to hear it, it is a nightmare. The Cold War era saw an arms race between global superpowers. The GAU-8 Avenger was conceived as a powerful answer to the formidable armored divisions of the Soviet Union. This wasn't just a weapon for an aircraft. The A-10 Thunderbolt II, colloquially named the Warthog, was essentially constructed around the GAU-8 Avenger. The relationship was so intertwined that without the gun, the aircraft had to be propped up to avoid tipping backward. To grasp the GAU-8's size, visualize it next to a Chevrolet sedan. Excluding other components, the gun stretches 9.35 feet and, with the ammunition feed system, a whopping 19.7 feet. Each barrel extends 7.55 feet. As for weight, when devoid of ammo, it stands at around 619 pounds. When fully packed, the combined weight of the gun and ammunition hovers close to 3,968 pounds. Drawing from the 19th century Gatling gun design, the GAU-8 is an intricate assembly of seven barrels rotating around a central axis. Instead of the Gatling's hard crank mechanism, the GAU-8 uses two hydraulic motors. As the central axis spins, cams guide each barrel through a cyclical process of loading, firing, unloading, and then reloading. What sets the GAU-8 apart is its self-sustaining firing system. Neither the recoil nor the gas from the discharged rounds drive the gun, ensuring that a misfired round doesn't halt subsequent firing. Powering this monumental weapon requires an intricate balance of mechanical and hydraulic energy. The dual hydraulic motors ensure the rapid, seamless rotation of the barrel assembly. This rotation, driven by the aircraft's power systems, facilitates the gun's extraordinary firing rates and ensures the stability of the entire mechanism even under intense operation. The ammunition employed by the GAU-8 is a tale of engineering genius. Each shell is a 30 by 173 mm cannon round, available in three variants. The armor-piercing incendiary variant is cloaked in an aluminum jacket which protects its formidable core made of depleted uranium. This is complemented by a high-exposure incendiary and more economically feasible target practice round. The size? Think of a standard Coca-Cola bottle. That's approximately the size of one of these rounds. Opting for lightweight aluminum cartridges over conventional brass or steel significantly increases the aircraft's ammo-carrying capacity. The magazine holds up to 1,174 rounds, but typically 1,150 rounds are loaded given the 575 round capacity for the loading cart. Upon initiation, the GAU-8's firepower is evident, dispensing 50 rounds within its first second. It subsequently intensifies to 65 rounds every second, translating up to 4,200 rounds in a minute. Its accuracy doesn't disappoint either. 80% of its shots, when fired from 3,937 feet, fall within a 39.4-foot diameter. With closely matching ballistic performances across ammo types, the PGU-14 API armor-piercing round exhibits a muzzle velocity of 3,323 feet per second. This projectile, weighing in at 0.87 rounds, generates an energy output of approximately 203,000 joules.
This energy is tenfold that of the acclaimed 0.50 BMG round. No car or tank offers adequate protection against this weapon. It slices through armor as effortlessly as a hot knife glides through butter. Engineers masterfully coupled the A-10 with the GAU-8 Avenger, crafting a union that elevated the A-10 to legendary status among aviation icons. However, integrating the GAU-8 into the A-10 was no small task. With the gun making up 16% of the Warthog's weight, the aircraft's balance was a significant concern. The gun's recoil mirrored the thrust of one of the Warthog's engines, making its alignment crucial. A misaligned gun could send the aircraft veering off course upon firing. Exhaust gases and the gun's powerful muzzle flash presented additional challenges. The flash risked blinding the pilot temporarily, while the oxygen-deprived exhaust gases could extinguish the engines. To combat these issues, engineers incorporated windscreen washers for soot removal and automatic engine igniters to reignite any snuffed-out engines. The US Air Force has committed to retaining the iconic A-10 Warthog close air support jet until 2040, ensuring that the legendary GAU-8 Avengers Symphony resonates for over another decade.